Welcome to this Brilliant Shows You How To video. We're going to investigate the mysteries of the Ulam Spiral. There are many mysteries in this world. Are there aliens? Is there a Loch Ness monster? Does Bigfoot really exist? I think he does, but who knows? And of course, there is the Bermuda Triangle a very mathematical mystery. But none of them compare to the mystery of the Ulam Spiral. The Ulam Spiral is one of those great mysteries, great unsolved mysteries of how it works. It concerns prime numbers, and prime numbers, as you all know, have exactly two factors, one and themselves. And if you look at how they're spaced out, they really don't have a regular interval, a regular pattern that shows you where the next one is coming from. But famously in 1963, Stanislav Ulam was bored in a lecture and he arranged the number grid in a spiral like this. And he wrote out all the numbers and started to color in all the prime ones. And he noticed something amazing. There is a pattern that emerges when you do this. So here I'm starting at one and going around in a spiral. I go up to about 300 or so, and then I color in the prime numbers. And they appear to line up in different ways. Let's have a look. So the first prime number there is two, then three, then five, and seven, and so on. Now at first, they just appear to be random boxes, but slowly you get diagonal lines appearing. And it's quite unexpected. You get four distinct diagonal lines coming from the center, going off at 45 degrees. Uh, now they're not perfect, there are some gaps, but the prime numbers definitely start to line up. And the more you do this, the more you can see these lines. So doing this by pen and paper can take quite a while. So I did this in Excel afterwards on a computer and this gave me more opportunity to have a look at where these lines are going. Uh, once you know where the lines are, you can start to predict where the prime numbers are going to be, which is harder to do if they're arranged in a normal left to right grid. So here are some of the lines uh, highlighted for us. There's lots of these going off uh, towards the corners of the screen. You can see these um, straight lines appearing and they carry on going forever. The prime numbers line up like this. Now you can see the gaps in between. Not every single square on those lines are prime, but there's lots of them. If you carry on this process on a larger and larger scale, you can create some amazing and mysterious images that highlight how the prime numbers are arranged. And it only works in this spiral style and different spirals and different ways of looking at it create different images but it truly is mysterious and fascinating.